What we doing? Getting money. What they doing? Hating on us. Let's go. Monster day on Saturday. 10 and 3 day on Saturday. That qualifies for another freaking monster. Degeneration. Boom. Suck it. Let's rip, baby. Monster Saturday. Wow. Benny here, GhostPixATS.com, the number one sports consultant in the business. Sunday, September 24th, got me pumped up. I've been pumped up since last night. 10 and 3 on uh, Sunday, or I mean on Saturday. Sunday fun day is today. NFL Sunday, $19.99, pinned right here to the top of the comment section. Select Benny as your handicapper. We'll flex on him, right? We be flexing on him. 10 and 3, what we doing? Getting money. What they doing? Hating on us. NFL Sunday is up. I went seven and one yesterday on my premium card, and then I went three and two on UFC. That is my day as a whole. Uh, it started with a sweep in soccer. We set that tone early, which I very, very much like to do. Winner on Crystal Palace, Fulham under two and a half. Winner on Ipswich, Blackburn over two and a half. Winner on Preston, Rotherham under two and a half. And then we went to baseball. Winner on the Orioles, check, ching. They went to college football, and I mean, absolutely crushed college football. And Saturdays are a lot about college football and UFC. Yeah, they're those special days. Winner on Wyoming, minus two and a half. Winner on Penn State, Iowa, under 38 and a half. Winner on Notre Dame, plus three and a half. Lost on Clemson. That was my only loss, and Clemson lost in overtime. Hmm. UFC, my only loss on my fight picks was Fiziev, Raphael Fiziev, and he got injured giving a leg kick, and that knocked him out. That was it. He got knocked out by himself. So, uh, I had I dropped my parlay. That was one of my losses on the day. It was a plus 180 parlay. I had Malcoon, and he got um, disqualified. So, I had a little weird stuff going on in UFC. I actually had, also had Malcoon on the blog to, to win by knockout. And he, he got disqualified. What? What? I had a winner on Jordan. Winner on Mohamed Usman. Winner on Means over one and a half. They were my fight picks for the day. And then again, we took the L on Fazee. So it's a lot of action on Saturdays. I know we came through really big again. Really big again. 10 and 3 day. Uh, it brings, and I, you know what? Once again, it brings us up very nicely on the week now. Now, today we finish off with NFL Sunday, $19.99 pinned right here at the top of the comment section. Lots of action at one. NFL football action today at one. Shout out of the day. We had a lot of people go for parlays and they got close, but it was no cigar. So instead we look elsewhere. Gregory Brain had a one point cover on Oklahoma minus 13. Dennis Conley had a one point cover on Rutgers getting plus 25. We had a minus 13 win. We had a plus 25 win. You're my shout outs for the day. Greg Brain, Dennis Conley. Rutgers lost 31 to 7, but they covered that 25 points. Oklahoma only won 20 to 6 this week, but they covered that 13 points, oddly enough. Nice wins, fellas. Nice wins. Today we're going NFL. Today we're going guess the correct outcome of tonight's game. Pittsburgh Steelers at Las Vegas Raiders. 8.20 p.m. Eastern Time. Guess the correct outcome in the comment section. Everybody's welcome to play. Steelers plus three and over 43. Steelers plus three and under 43. Raiders minus three and over 43. Raiders minus three and under 43. And I swear to you. I better see something from Najee tonight. And I better see something from Pickett tonight. And I better see something from Pat Fryermuth tonight. I bought into some of that hype early off season, thinking the Steelers had potential, you know? I drafted some of those guys on my fantasy teams. And all I'm left with is frustration, you know? Mostly Najee Harris, you know? And I drafted him in like three leagues. But uh, uh, I drafted Najee, I drafted Deontay Johnson, Fryermuth, Deontay Johnson is on IR, and Najee and Fryermuth each have about three points over two weeks. Need to see something before I go freaking nuts. Let's get a free play. 1 p.m. Eastern time, New Orleans Saints at Green Bay Packers. Free play a day. I'm taking Green Bay Packers money line. This one is close. I'm not overly expecting a crazy, exciting, offensive shootout battle in this one, but we saw last week Saints versus Panthers. It was just very slow. Uh, Derek Carr 
looked terrible offensively until later in the game where the Saints started moving. Jordan Love has been efficient so far this year. Very efficient. He's really been taking care of the ball. Now, they're a little one-dimensional, though. The Packers' offense is a little one-dimensional, and now you have the Saints' defense coming to Lambeau to play. And again, it's a very close. Odds are super close. Saints are plus one, and they're minus 102 on the money line. Packers are minus one, minus 118 on the money line. Saints are 2-0 and oh so far this year, and to me, last week, again, they looked all, 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 like awful offensively at first. They kind of picked it up later as that game went on, and they were able to be... Uh, crappy Carolina teams that we, we cra and can we'll call it what it is Carolina is not good right now they're crappy but I, I I hope they get better um we'll see what Derek Carr does up in Green Bay you know Kamara is not back yet he'll be back next week Saints are coming off a short week as well this week Packers they looked good last week but then they lost and that was good for me because I was on the Falcons money line and I've been waiting as long as I could to see here if it, what was going on with Aaron Jones. You know, but I can't wait any longer. We got to roll. Packers are, uh, you know, again, we're kind of one-dimensional. Saints defense is good. Packers, they played three good quarters last week. Now we just need them to make it four here at home. Free play of the day. I'm going with the Green Bay Packers money line. Sunday fun day. Pinned right here to the top of the comment section. Select Benny as your handicapper. Right? And we roll. All right? In the NFL. That's it. That's all I'm doing today. Hey, nice and easy. Nice and easy, baby. Jimmy has a red alert today. Jimmy has a red alert in the NFL. Don't forget that. Everything's listed right here in the comment section. Let's have a good day. As always, 10 and 3, Benny. Checking out. Good luck. God bless. Grind on, baby. Cheers.